Yo, what is going on guys? It's your boy Aptic Scumpy. Tomorrow is Mother's Day, so today I'm gonna have a cool video going up for you later in the day. This is gonna be my first. We're gonna be doing a K7 challenge video. I'm sorry that I'm talking really rapid fire right now, but I'm trying to lower this uh, introduction to the lowest that I can get it. But we're gonna be using the K7 with armor piercing rounds and a holographic sight. The recoil on this gun is usually pretty bad unless they've buffed or nerfed that I haven't really been keeping up with the K7 because I don't use it, but you got your standard slang smg class for me right there pause the video but i hope you guys enjoyed it. if you like favorite comment subscribe don't forget to vote down in the straw poll below and as always this is your brother gonna be uh see you in the video hell yeah babies as you can see we got literally i i don't actually mean to call you guys babies like i'm just saying that like you got you know what i'm saying i'm not actually calling you like small infant toddler children i'm calling you like my baby yeah you get it you get it but we got the best map that we could have possibly gotten for this challenge we got blitz on freight i'm not lying to you guys this was literally the first match because usually i have to cycle through because if i get search and destroy i tend to back out because search and destroy it's just you get one life and then you're done it really doesn't make a good challenge video because you just like i said you get one life and then it's over for the rest of the round so with a map like this it's constant high speed action constant gunfights constant engagements so this should be a lot of fun i didn't mess up my class which is great i usually get something in there that is banned in this playlist and i have to filter out and then go back in it's just a pain in the ass but as you can see rocking the wolf shirt today i got my buddies with me good for good luck but if you guys are wondering what the second video is going to be because i know uh, you guys are probably you know like what the hell is it going to be it's going to be uh, a video log with somebody. I'll tell you that much. It'll be a video log with somebody. Okay. Okay. First engagement. Wow. Okay, then. He just, like, two-shot headshot at me in the head. I put, like, five bullets into him at least. Okay. So, my, I actually like the way this looks, though. The way that the gun looks. We got to close this door right here. And I'm playing on the Xbox One, if you're wondering. This is on the Xbox One. Xbox One is the best. I'm just going to play for caps. If my teammates aren't going to do it, I might as well do it. It's just an easy cop-out for me. If I do end up getting a bad kill-to-death ratio or don't get as many kills as I would like. But it looks like my teammates have them pretty pinned down in the, in the spawn trap back there. I'm actually going to go ahead and put them in the next level spawn trap. Oh, never mind. My teammate died. That would have been great to put them in. I would have got a couple of kills. Probably got a cap at the end of it. That would have been great. Everybody would have been winning there. Ooh! A little wall bang action for you right there. Okay, what's going on here? Why are all my teammates shooting? Oh, oh, he's on top of it. Let's go. Killing a cap. This is this is actually not that hard of a challenge right now. I thought that this gun was going to be bad. Uh, you know, the MTAR and the Vector are pretty superior to any other submachine gun, but this is holding its own. Kill! Bitch, don't kill my vibe. Get out of my face. And like I was saying, the MTAR and the Vector are pretty superior to any other submachine gun that you could possibly use. So I thought that this was going to be difficult, but this gun actually isn't bad. There's not that much recoil. Has a pretty high kill rate. I'm going to cap before I die. Yeah, that guy was trying to shoot me in the back right there. It's overall just not a bad gun. But, oh, wow. Did that guy just throw... Was that a throwing knife? You, I don't know if you guys could hear that, but it was like a little clink, clink. It sounded like it, sounded like it was a throwing knife. I'm not really sure, but... Oof. I actually really I like this gun. What the hell? I'm gonna have to go ahead and just say pass already. I'm eight and one. I'm gonna have to just say I already passed this challenge. Eight and one, two caps. Going off on the main stage. But now nah, there's still a long game to be played. I could still start to choke up here a bit, which I don't think is gonna happen. Hopefully, but you never know. Let's play for the cap right there. See, the thing with clan versus clan is you're not always going to get really, really good players. Like, in Black Ops 2, you had leagues, and you would always be playing somebody in your league, so they wouldn't be, you know, completely terrible. Oh, my gosh, my knife is just filthy today. So they wouldn't be completely terrible, but they wouldn't be, like, you know, pro level either. But it'd at least be a little bit more fair of a match. But right now, I'm just racking up the points right here. If this isn't a pass, you guys are just being butts. Oh, my teammate just saved me. Oh, my bullets! Oh, my gosh! What was he looking at? I don't even think he knew what he was looking at. That is great. I should have died. Any other player right there? Not any other player, but pretty much I'm dead in that situation. But I somehow managed to stay alive. No! Oh! Another one spawned behind me. Oh, that could have been... That was like getting close up there to that KEM level shit right there. Oh, one of them left. 
work. He can't handle the heat, so he's got to get out of the kitchen. That's fine. No worries there at all. I'm still going to rock this out. Ooh. See, this is what I was saying. I got out of my rhythm. I was in that rhythm, and now I'm getting taken out of it. Can I recover? Can I bounce back? I'm on a two-death streak right now. I was on, like, a 12-kill streak, and I went down to a two-death streak. So we'll see if I can recover here. Hopefully one of the another person will join on the team. I don't really like whenever people leave, especially when I'm doing challenge videos, because uh, it's just like someone left. But it is what it is. It's still pretty early in the game, so I think that we can still make a pretty productive and good video out of this. So we're gonna stay. Where are they spawning? Oh, here's one. Oh, where's he going? He's juking me out. He doesn't know it. Where are the rest of them? There's another one. Ooh, this gun melts, dude. Holy crap! You know, it's it's awesome whenever you discover a new gun that isn't bad. Because, like, I've always been under the the typical pro stereotype that if um if this gun isn't used by the pros, it's not really going to be that good. But this gun's not bad. It's definitely not a contender with the MTAR or the Vector, but it can it can still kill people. It's not, like, awful. But we just got a Proofy EL joined in. So we're playing against one of my teammates here, Proofy. It's not actually him, but... That'd be cool if it was. Oh my gosh, can I get the quad? Wow! Look at me! Look at this gun! Look at it! I didn't do anything special there. Nothing. Oh. No, I'm gonna die though. They got a weird spawn there. We had literally every single spawn blocked off. And he didn't stay in the game very long. He did not last very long in the game. He actually left pretty quickly. He couldn't handle the K7, which makes sense. Nobody can really handle it. Nobody can really handle the K7 whenever the Scum Man is using it. But, alright. Still 4v3. I hate, like, I just woke up. I don't know if you guys get this. I still wear a retainer at night. But when I wake up, I get, like, shit on the inside of the, my mouth. I don't really know what it is. It's not actually poop. But, like, it's just weird. I don't know what it is, dude. It's weird. I hate it. See, like, this is what I was talking about with the recoil. Super high recoil. It's got a pretty fast... This gun's design actually reminds me of the MP5 back from Call of Duty 4, like the, the muzzle on it. It reminds me of the MP5 silencer back in Call of Duty 4, which is one of my favorite guns to use in public matches. That was the shit. MP5 silencer was like the best gun ever. Oh, I'm totally getting in here. You are not closing that door on me, bro. Well, Alright, looks like I'm just going to have free reign here with my caps. I can just keep on running train. Aw, oh, man. Till I die, of course. All right, there we go. Now we got another fourth, four v four again. Thirteen to six. This is still feasible for them to come back, but I don't really think it's gonna happen. Especially not whenever I'm twenty three and five with eight caps. I just don't. I just don't think that they can come back at this point. Oh my goodness! This gun is a tank. Oh, and by the way, I almost forgot to say. If you guys have any suggestions that you think would be a good challenge video or something that would actually challenge me. Uh, I always do these in clan versus clan. I never do them in pubs. So if you guys have any suggestions on challenges, I check the comments really. Uh, I check the comments a lot on these videos because you guys usually give me some pretty good ideas. This one was self thought of. I'm sure someone said it. I I didn't see anything like this in the comments, but wow, that guy just ate a shit ton of bullets. I hit him again at the end. I guess it didn't really register though. But uh, like I was saying, I usually get ideas from you guys. Um, this one I thought of myself because I thought it was just sort of off the wall, but, uh, um, I usually check the comments to see if you guys have any good ideas that I can use. Oh, I don't want to die. 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 There's one back there. I'm just going to go for the cap. Teleport me back to my base. Sweet. Now I'm out of harm's way. It's the best thing about Blitz. You can just, if you're scared of dying, just teleport. It's like a little, little portal. That's what it is. It is a portal. It takes you to another dimension. Okay. This guy has them spawn traps. It's all he like he is just kill whoring in their base. So there's nothing wrong with making a video. My mom's trying to claw her way in here. I don't know why. It's my damn room. It's my goddamn room. All right, let's go. Sort of threw off the, the momentum of the video. Like she has to I have to make her text me whenever she wants to come up here. That's what needs to start happening. You have to text me first before you can come upstairs at all. I run upstairs. Upstairs is my realm. That's where I reside. Alright, two dead. Nice. 
Oh my goodness. You guys can just see how tough these long range shots are to hit. Oh, he's still laying there. Wow. And the vector just melts. Like, look at that. That's what I'm saying. I think the vector literally overtook the MTAR. I'm pretty sure that I'm, I'm almost positive the vector is better than the MTAR now. In fact, I know it is. Yeah, bro. What you gonna do about that one? I'm closing underground. They're gonna stop coming from there like little rodents coming from underground. Like little miners. Ooh, someone's using a pistol. Alright, well, I'm just gonna slide up in here. Slide up in net. But this is a this is an easy challenge video, like I said. I didn't expect it to be this easy, but it turned out to be not too bad. But when I get in gunfights like that, you can see, when I get in a gunfight with any other gun, it's pretty it's pretty hard. But when I'm not in a gunfight, whenever I'm just rotating spawns or spawn trapping them or stuff like that, it's very, very easy. But whenever I get in a gunfight, that's whenever all hell breaks out. I just I'm not gonna win a gunfight against guns like this. Oh, I can barely win one against a sniper. That guy melted me, hit me with the melt machine, with the vector melt machine. But I don't know if this has happened to you guys, but I keep getting reset. So I was originally in the ninth prestige. I was originally in ninth prestige level 20, and it, wow, that guy just melted. I was originally in ninth prestige level 20, and then it reset me, actually. I'm not sure why it did, but the game reset me. And I'm pretty, I was pretty upset about it. Because I was like, like I said, I was a level 20. And it reset me all the way down to a level 35. I bet I got it back up to a level 53. But I was a level 35. That's how far it took me down. I was so upset. Because like, I, I literally played for six hours. Six and a half hours one day to prestige on stream. And then it just reset me. I was so, so, I was so mad. It was insane. I was really mad right there. That would have been a two-piece. But that's going to be the end of the challenge video, guys. Like I said, please, please vote. Either pass or fail on this one. I believe I'm 4 and 2. I'm either 4 and 2 or 4 and 3. I need to start keeping a better track of that. But let me know about all the things that I said throughout the video, about different videos and different games and such. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, like, favorite, comment, subscribe, follow me on Twitter. It'll be down in the description below. And as always, guys, this is your boy, Optics Scumpy. Aww, see ya.